A multi-million dollar low-income housing complex is slated for construction in Bay City, but neighbors on the city's west side are pushing back, saying they're concerned about who will move into their neighborhood. NBC 25's Walter Smith Randolph has more from Bay City. Victor's Landing would bring 60 low to moderate income housing units here to Monday Avenue on Bay City's west side. 18 of those units would be set aside for veterans. Many neighbors around here say they don't like the project, while supporters say it's much needed here in the community. This land is not that big, and to go in and stick 60 units, that's, that's wrong. Libby McFarland, one of many neighbors unhappy with the $8 million housing project. The Bay City resident of 18 years says, not in my backyard. I want something that's going to bring revenue and jobs to Bay City, and I want something that's going to attract people down here because it's a beautiful area. Developers of the project, Ohio-based Woda Group, seeking a tax break to build along the waterfront. The number of new residents coming in here does change the neighborhood. Uh, can the streets and the infrastructure handle all those new residents. But supporters of the project say the pushback is because of misconceptions. We are trying to help people to become independent. Um, this is not Section 8 housing. This is income-based housing. I don't want to judge people, but if it turns into another Baytown, it's going to be ruined. It's not about a handout. It's about a stepping stone up to a better life. Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News.